Um, welcome to this video for GCSE Maths where we're going to be looking at changing the subject of the formula. This is for students um, who are either new to the subject or aiming for a grade that is between a, a D and a B grade. So the best way to do this is just to try lots of um, examples. So I'm going to take you through um, a number of examples and when you feel ready, um, pause the video and then try and have a go through these, um, a few of these for yourself. So this is our question, make x the subject. Um, so the first thing we need to do is to get rid of the 3. So I'm going to plus 3 to both sides. So that gives me y plus 3 equals 4x minus 3 plus 3. But because we have minus 3 and a plus 3 on this side, we can just cross those out. So what we have is y plus 3 equals 4x. The next thing we need to do is to get rid of the 4 from this side and because it's 4 times x we need to divide by 4. So y, oops, let me change color. y plus 3 divided by 4 equals 4, x divided by 4, and then because we have a 4 and a 4 here, they cancel each other out, so our answer is y plus 3 divided by 4 equals x. Here we need to make t the subject of the formula, so the first thing that we need to do is to minus the 40, so s minus 40 equals 3t plus 40 and of course we need to do the same sides, same to both sides, minus 40 because we have a plus 40 and minus 40 here um, it cancels each, uh, they cancel each other out so we end up with s minus 40 equals 3t now we need to get rid of the 3 over this um, over the right hand side of the equation so we divide everything by 3 so what we end up with is s minus 40 divided by 3 equals 3t divided by 3. And because we have 3 on the top and the bottom, they cancel each other out. So our answer is s minus 40 divided by 3 equals t. Here again we need to make t the subject of the formula. Um, and we have an extra 4 on the right hand side, so the first thing we need to do is to minus 4. So we have s minus 4 equals 3t plus 4 minus 4. And then the plus 4 and the minus 4 cancel each other out. So what we have is my s minus 4 equals 3t. We need to divide by the 3. Um, to get rid of it from the right hand side, so we end up with s minus 4 divided by 3 equals 3t divided by 3. And because we have 3s on both sides of the equation here, what you actually end up with is s minus 4 divided by 3 equals t. Here we need to make w the um, subject, so the first thing we need to do is to take away 8. So we have y minus 8 equals 3w plus 8 minus 8 plus 8 minus 8 cancel each other out. So y equals y minus 8 equals 3w. Then we need to divide by 3. So we end up with y minus 8 divided by 3 equals 3w divided by 3. Because um, here we have 3 on the top and the bottom, it cancels each other out. So our answer is y minus 8 divided by 3 equals w. Here we need to make p the subject of the formula. So we have 8 that we don't want on the right hand side, so we need to minus an 8. So we have q minus 8 equals 4 plus 8 minus 8 the plus 8 and the minus 8 cancel each other out so 
So we have q minus h equals 4p. Then what we need to do is to divide by 4. So q minus 8 divided by 4 equals 4p divided by 4. Because we have 4 on top and we have 4 on the bottom, they cancel each other out. So we have q minus 8 over 4 equals 4.